My belief is that to whom much is given, much is expected. Um, and service is an important part of, of, of a rich life. Um, I think no matter what industry you're a part of. From Haiti's home to the Panhandle, I love helping people. I like seeing the reactions when we get the job done, and it's just the best feeling. Really enjoyed seeing Jim. Jim was a, actually the veteran that we were working, working on the house for. Seeing him there was a lot of motivation to come every day. You know, a lot of times these veterans come back home and they have a lot of trouble. And he's just one of those guys that had a lot of trouble coming back home. And to be able to get him in a home was one of the big benefits to working on that project last semester. But the last few years, we've really uh, expanded our opportunities for the students. Uh, we now have dedicated service learning classes. And uh, those classes really allow our students to uh, be engaged with the community and really to, to serve those who cannot do for themselves. I do believe in the Auburn Creed. You know, I have a, f a full belief that that creed runs deep in any student who, who comes through our school. And our students show that. Um, and the creed ha having that line about the human touch is something that I, I fully believe is something that they want to show and that they're, they demonstrate every day, uh, particularly through the service learning opportunities. I mean, it's amazing. Yeah, I think we took a, a, a big leap of faith by, by making the course a required course. Um, we felt that if we made it a required course, every student gets the opportunity to do service learning. Chrissy's family, my wife's name is Chrissy, her family was affected by the hurricane as well. So once that uh, Panama City area was brought up, I was like, man, sign me up, I'm going. And, uh, and it was awesome. I mean, going there and it's, you know, it's uncomfortable because you see how comfortable we are. You know, my bed is big and, and it's comfortable when we slept on those cards in the church and, you know, on a concrete floor and you're like, man, I don't like that a lot. But third night, it was not about the cot. It was not about the, how you feel because all of a sudden you're just so joyful getting up in the morning and working for free, you know. And uh, that's, that's, the, that's the heart, you know, the serve and giving back heart. And that's something that Auburn is really instilling in us, too, is always have the mindset of giving back as well. Because, uh, you know, you can be really fortunate doing this, but giving, never forget your roots and always give back, right? Because uh, not everybody is as lucky as we are, for sure.